Hi crafty friends, it's Sylvia. How's, I hope everyone's having a wonderful night and I hope everyone had a wonderful weekend with family and friends. So today we're gonna do an unboxing from Dreamer Design and believe it or not guys, this is the second time that I'm trying to record this video because it was either the lighting or the sound. It's one of those days or one of those nights. Okay, so this is from Dreamer Design and it's called Reach Toward the Skies and it's by Mikey Bergman. There's a picture on the bottom but the box is too big. It's a big painting. But anyway, it comes in a very pretty box. Uh, it says scan me, redeem for 15% off. And it basically tells you some of the features. Um, it has sparkling diamonds with ABs. It's legally licensed image. It's a full drill. It's soft fabric canvas with poured glue and it's lifetime warranty plus OO insurance. And then in the back, it basically tells you how it works, step by step, and what's inside the kit. And why diamond paint? Because it helps to, re it says it reduces stress and anxiety, improves your focus, helps your fine motor skills, increases your social circle, and helps to spark creativity. All wonderful things, right? Why not um, diamond paint? Okay, this is a biggie, guys. So let's open this baby again. All right, here's the kit, the toolkit. Here's the beautiful painting. And as you can see, the painting comes in a reusable uh, carry bag, just in case you're traveling. And you also have a reusable uh, toolkit bag, which is very nice. So let's see what comes in here. Open this baby. All right, put that over there. It has resealable bags, just in case you do not have containers with you to put the drills, you could use these. It comes with two waxes. It comes with two pens. This is a single place, single placer. So you could actually pick one drill at a time. And here you have some multi-placers. So I think you could pick three and this one maybe six or seven. And then this is a straightener. So this is where you straighten out your drills. These are uh, comfort, uh, com it's called comfort grip. And this is supposed to slide in your pen and help with comfort, which I'm um, having difficulty right now, but that's okay. Life goes on, and then there's tweezers, square tweezers, very, very, square tweezers. <laughs> this is tweezers that are very sharp, okay? And of course, it comes with a purple tray, and then in the bottom it says Dreamer Design. So basically, it has everything you need, you need if you are a beginner or a newbie. All right, put that aside. All right, let's open this baby. I love that it has this carry bag, you know, it protects it. Okay. All the canvases from Dreamer, um, Dreamer, Dreamer Design, <laughs> oh my gosh, um, has a purple ribbon. Let's take it off. Like I mentioned earlier, the canvas is very soft, which is very nice. The drills, I believe there's two bags, because there is a lot of drills in this one. I think it's 68 drills. I'm just sticking my hand in here so I can get the... Uh, Oh, mamma mia. I'm telling you guys, it's definitely one of those nights. I'm just unrolling it so I can get the sticker and the other drills. All right. Let's put the canvas to the side. All right. So as you can see, it comes with two bags. And it tells you that the painting, this, these drills belong to that painting. Reach towards the stars. 2-1 and 2-2. Two, two. So there's two bags. All right, we don't need this right now. I'm gonna put that on the floor for now. And his, here's a sticker. I love the sticker because you could actually use this to decorate your um, log book, which is pretty cool. It has a beautiful, look at, the, look at the painting, guys. It's a beautiful fairy. Reach towards the sky. I mean, reach towards the stars, I'm sorry. Reach towards the stars by Mikey Bergman, artlicensing.com. And it is a square. And then you can put your start date and your end date and then more stickers to decorate your logbook. And of course, here are the pre-cut stickers. And it says it has 68 beautiful, vibrant colors. All right, so let's open this baby up. Uh, let's start here on the top. Again, reach towards the stars. Mikey Bergman, artlicensing.com, design size is 60 by 90 centimeters, which is 23.6 by 35.4. And then on the right hand on the top, it basically um, 
It tells you where to find them, Dreamer Design, uh, which is YouTube, Facebook, uh, Pinterest, and Instagram. All right. And then in the bottom, all the way in the bottom, in the middle, it says Paint with Passion. And the left-hand side, it's just the, the Dreamer Lifetime Warranty. Your, ca your diamond canvas kit comes with a lifetime warranty and free missing diamonds protection from Dreamer Designs, which is nice. And then in the corner, it just says Dreamer Designs again. And then, of course, it does come with two legends. So there's one legend on the bottom of the left-hand side and then another legend on the right. Uh, move it over here so you can see it. On the right-hand side, okay, on the top. Now let's look at the legend. The legend does come in handy. Some people use it, some people don't. I do. I love it. Okay, so the legend, the first row, it basically tells you that it has 68 colors. And then in the middle... Those are the symbols, and the symbols are what you find in the painting. That's where you're going to place your drills. And then, of course, the third row is the DMC code. And down here, it tells you that it has one, two, three, four, five ABs. Okay? And ABs just stands for Aurora Borealis, which means it's just going to be a drill with an extra shine to them. All right? So now we're going to look at this beautiful painting. Look at the colors in this, guys. It's very, very vibrant. Beautiful. So there's a description... And I wanted to read it to you very quickly. And it says, In the heart of an enchanted twilight, a fairy with translucent iridescent wings that glimmer with a constellation of colors reaches, reaches out towards a cascade of twinkling stars. Here are the stars. Her flowing gown, a tapestry of twilight hues, cascades like a river merging with the celestial horizon where day meets night in a symphony of sunset colors. And that is a great description. I love it. So what do we see? We see this beautiful fairy. She's got beautiful brown long hair. And she's got some flowers on her hair. I will need the picture. So let me see if I can find the picture here very quickly. Yeah, there it is. Get this closer to me so I can see it better. And then you have the moon in the sky. And you have some twinkling stars. And all above her, it's like this, it's like, it looks like a rainbow of colors. But it also looks like corals, like swirls. Um, it's just beautiful. And then, of course, the sky. The sky, you have all these different kinds of blues. And then you have gradually like lighter blues, some beige or whites here, some greens, some yellow, some orange. Just beautiful, beautiful colors. And then again, more. It's like that, whatever that was on the top, like corals, it comes all the way down here. And then it looks like this is part of the river. It's all connected. And of course, here you have, these are like mountains. Here you have more mountains. And then of course, all this is her beautiful dress. It goes all the way down. So it's sort of like, it looks like it, just like a uh, pillowing, um, uh, uh, cloudy. So I don't know if this is like, like, she, like she's rising and going up, trying to reach to the stars. It's just beautiful, guys. She's pointing. She's pointing to the stars. And I just love the colors of her wings. I just love fairies. And um, and it's very, very clear. So I'm going to bring it up so you can see. It is a square. But look at this. How clear that is. Okay. See what I mean? Those are like swirls. And there goes the moon and the stars. Okay. The fairy, she's pointing. She's got this beautiful dress. Look at those wings, guys. Okay, and the dress, look how it flows. Wow, it looks like the ocean, right? Like the waves, and then all the way in the bottom. It's just gorgeous. And um, I was going to say something, now I forgot. It happens to me all the time. Well, anyway, yes, so I just love this painting, guys. So now I'm just going to bring out the colors, and we're going to go over the colors and find out where the ABs belong. Okay, okay I'm back. Actually, this is the second time, guys, because I made a boo-boo and I had to start over. Yep, in the second part. All right, so these are the colors. 154, 161, 161, and 169. Very pretty. It's like a sage. These colors are spectacular, guys. All right, let's see. And then we have three bags of 310, which is black. 315 and 
Uh, let's see. I think this one's next. No, where is... Oh, here it is. Here's seven. Um, 356. And then you have 434, 435, and 436. And it's sort of like in the orange, yellow, brown color. Very pretty. And 500. And that's like a green, like a very dark olive green. And then this one is 550. It's purple. I'm going to put it up here. Uh, 564. 597, 598. These are all so pretty. It's like a blue greens, which I love. And 720 and 721. Both orange, but one is darker than the other. Then you have 722. It's a lighter orange. 738 and 739. And 791 and 792. Beautiful. Can you see that one? Okay. So, so far, as you can see, it's got like a little bit of everything. So, I'm just going to move these aside because we need more space. They are a lot of colors. How many do we say? 68. Okay. I'm going to go try to move this fast. All right. 793, uh, 796, and 797, all in the blue family. Oh, here's another one, 799 and 801 the brown put it up here here you have 801 also brown 814 815 and 820 so pretty uh 823 three bags of 823 looks like a navy blue 895 is a green and 917 very little of that one it's like in the pink family I just dropped one. 920. I'll put this one here. 938. Two bags of 938. It's like a brown. And then you have 939. You have five bags. And it's like a blue. It's a very pretty blue. It's a darker blue, but it's very pretty. I'm just going to fold it. And then you have 976. 977. Both again, like in that orange brown color. And 3325, very pretty blue. It reminds me of a pumpkin. All right, and then over here you have 3345, 3346, and 3347, and 3348. These are all in the green family. And this is 3371, two bags, and that's brown. All right. So I'm going to move these out of the way. Lots of blues, lots of pinks, lots of purples, lots of orange. Like I said, a little bit of everything. Now you're going to have more pinks here, I think. 3607, 3726, love that color. 3733, and 3750. Beautiful. Almost finished. Uh, 3756. 3371. It looks like a salmon. These two look like salmons. 3778 and 3825 and 3826. 3827. 3830. Ah, uh, that's pretty. And 3834 and 3835 and 3836 all in the purple family. And this is the last one. 3841 blue, 3847 the green, 3848 green also, 3855 and love this one, 3861. Wow, and the shine to these regular drills is pretty nice. All right, love it. Now we're going to bring the ABs very quickly. Five ABs, and ABs just stands for Aurora Borealis, it's just a drill with an extra shine. So you have AB08, it's like a white, AB37, look at the shine, love it, it's yellow, AB211, very little of this one, it's like a light, light purple, 
AB 772, this is like a yellow green. And AB 798, this is like a blue. Very pretty. Like a blue violet. All right, so I'm going to be bring back the painting. And let's see if we can find where these ABs go. All right, put this over here on this side. All right, AB 08 is going to be symbol O, capital O. So it's basically, you know, it's going to be easier because it's white, right? So it's all over on the side of her dress. It goes all the way up, up, up her skirt. Let's see. All the way up to here. No, some over here. I just need to slide it down. There's some on her chest, some on her shoulder. Uh, any on her wings? Nope. Definitely on the moon around the moon on the stars wow that's gonna be really pretty okay and then you have some up here very little here okay let's put that one aside the next one is a b 37 that's gonna be symbol a capital a any up here let's see since we're up here yep right there there goes the a's uh and that's gonna be in that like I said, they look like swirls and they look like uh, corals that you find in the ocean, in the water. And then you have some A's here on her wing, some here, six scattered. Then you have some over here, There's some A's here, here. Uh, oh, it's on the star, it's on the moon. Wow, and more here in this star. And there you have some on her shoulder, on her sleeve. Some of her dress, and definitely down here on the, it's like a flare, her dress. It's, oh, it's, it's, it's absolutely gorgeous. And then, of course, you have some down here, again, on her dress. Okay. Oh, oh, oh what are we? Oh, over here, guys, on the sky. It's all over the sky. And, of course, you also have these white ones on the sky. The sky is absolutely beautiful, the colors. All right. The next one is AB211, and this is the scent. Sign. Not a lot of this, but I already see it. This one right here. You have a couple here. It's like a very faint purple. You have some here. That's going to be part, again, of her dress. All right. Let's see. Any up here? I don't think so. Oh, no. Oh, I take that back. It's, got, it's on her wing. Right there. It's on her wing. How about up here? Nope. On this wing? Nope. Okay. The next one. This one is AB772, and it's going to be the number sign. All right. Let's see. And it's green. It's like a yellow green, really. Let's see. I did see it earlier. Let's see. Where are you? They always hide when you are looking for them guys why is that huh i know i saw this remember you're looking for like a yellow what did i say number sign aha right here see it's not like green it's on her wing on this wing here i don't see any more as you can see it's very little of this one too but i'm sure it's scattered all right and the last one which is this one it's a lot of this one and this is going to be, it's like a triangle, but sideways, slanted. So, and it's blue. All right, so let's see. Any up here on the sky, on the swirls here? Nope. How about, yep, right here. You have some again on the moon. That moon is going to be super shiny. You have some on the stars. Okay, some on this star, some on this star. How about on the wing? Uh, yep. Right here on the wing, this wing area here. And her dress. Nope, I don't see any. Let's see, I'll just slide it down. Oh, right down here. Again, it's on the bottom of her dress. Wow. It's gorgeous. And then you have more over here, like in the water, the river. All right absolutely gorgeous guys and it's very very clear which i love i'm gonna push this back so we don't see the glare um i'm just gonna 
I mean, I don't know. I can't, it, the, the, it's very, the, the um, you see that? Look at the symbols. Just very, very clear. Love that. And the colors are vibrant. This is beautiful. Look at those wings. Look at that. I mean, it's heavy, heavy confetti. That I can tell you. Her whole, the whole fairy is going to be confetti. And confetti is basically going to have to be changing your drills a lot. But then you have some color blocking in the sky. Like around this area, up here. And color blocking is going to be the same color. It's the same drill. But everything else, all this, <laughs> sort of like a rainbow. All this is confetti. So this is confetti heaven. I actually like confetti uh, more than color blocking. Um, yeah, so I don't mind that. But yeah, so that's about it, guys. I hope you love her as much as I do. And um, I hope you guys had a wonderful uh, weekend. And have a wonderful rest of the week. And thank you very much. Bye-bye.